How is the project going? We found a couple of diaries, one by this boy named Sean and hey. the other by his girlfriend, Chelsea. <laughs> hey! What do you think, Mr. G? What does this have to do with exploitation? Oh, oh, we're getting to Not as though she's not doing it willingly. But she's being manipulated! Dude, this happens all the time, all right? Totally harmless. What Jay's brother and his boys are doing is sexual exploitation, even though they probably never dreamt that's what they're doing. They, they probably just think that they're messing around. Horrible. Yeah. Not as horrible as what happens to Chelsea, though. Okay, let's take a look. Do I need to do anything? Yeah. You need to play Gary. Who's Gary? You'll see. Chelsea met him online and they got talking. My life sucks. I'm listening. Only really got one good friend. I think they're all idiots. You're beautiful. He sometimes gets angry if I turn off my phone. It's really horrible. It's exploiting and manipulating. Earlier we saw him being, you know, kind and funny and understand and make her want to trust you him. You are mine now. You understand? <sighs> This actually happens. I'm afraid that it does. It'd be easier if schools do it, but like every year they can learn more about it. Talkback was what essential. How do you provide a space to really unpack it with students, reinforce the importance of doing prevention work, but doing it from a very empowering, healthy relationship based? Chelsea's story. 